Beverage over here, Aaron, and actually welcome to the cooking corner, but today it's actually the drink making corner. We're happy to welcome back Stacy Jones from the OSU Extension doing a sparkling blueberry lemonade. Welcome in. Hi, Reagan. You've also got a guest. I do. Her name is Jenny. She is our intern for the summer, and she is going to be helping me make this very spectacular drink. Awesome. Well, we appreciate your help today. So what Jenny is going to be doing is she is uh, starting to boil the blueberries, the sugar, and the the water together. That's basically a simple syrup. Okay. Easy enough. You could do it with strawberries, cranberries, any other berries that you would like. From here, we're going to turn it off and we're going to put it into the cheesecloth. Now, the reason why we do this is because not only do you not want pulp in your simple syrup, yeah, probably not. <laughs> you also uh, don't want those seeds. So, as you can see, it kind of comes through here a little bit slowly, and that's what you want to see. You want to see it drain just very, very slowly. Then after we get it drained and cooled down a little bit, if you could help me out. I can do that. What are we doing? So we're going to be pouring the blueberry simple syrup into the pitcher. Okay. So there this we is, go. Yeah. Thank you so much. The lemon juice. Okay. So this is one of the recipes that was featured um, for uh, one of our community partners on Food on the Move. And if you could also put in the sparkling water. Sparkling water, okay. Mm-hmm. Uh, our CNET program uh, actually does recipes for Food on the Move. And this was one of the ones that she specialized in this month. It's quite the good, uh, good drink for a week like this when it's nice and hot. It's good. Yep. So one of the things that you can do about this, because you can pour it all the way up, you can water it down, you could have still water, or you could even add in some of your favorite liquid beverages that are 21 and older approved. <laughs> My pouring skills today aren't very good. You are a little, fine. A little fizzy. Mm -hmm. So um, that is basically it. If you want to pour it into... You stir it up a little bit. You can. And then you can pour it into the cup and garnish how you like. It's nice and refreshing, and it also uses uh, some things that you may not Just toss think them about. in? Yep. Toss them in? Great thing is, if you have them frozen, it actually keeps the drink colder. Look at that. Putting me to work today. I know. <laughs> well, easy as that. Stacy, thank you so much for being here, as always. We appreciate you. We'll be right back after this break.